You know the first official visit of Japanese government officials to North America and Europe? In the fall of 1613, a delegation was sent across the Pacific with the express purpose of discussing trade agreements with the Spanish and also meeting the Pope. Japanese citizens had visited North America and Europe before, but this was the first time it involved a government official. The ship was called the San Juan Bautista. Its construction was overseen by experts who had been trained by William Adams, the man who provided Japan with long-range ship technology. The head of the mission was Hasekura Rokuemon Tsunenaga, a samurai who was a retainer of Date Masamune, the daimyo in charge of the Tohoku region in northern Japan. The reason for Tsunenaga is that Masamune was in charge of the entire project. It included a number of samurai tradesmen and about 40 southern barbarians, as the Japanese referred to the Europeans. The most notable barbarians were the explorer Vizcaino and a Franciscan friar named Luis Sotelo. The ship left from northern Japan in either September or October, depending on if you're looking at Japanese or non-Japanese records. The confusion relates to the lunar calendar and how historical dates are referenced in Japanese history. It is notable, though, that there was a perception issue between Spain and Japan on the voyage. For Japan, it was an issue of trade, particularly for Masamune, whose area was resource-poor and saw allowing Christianity into northern Japan as a way of creating business. For the Spanish, it was a way to spread Catholicism in northern Japan, with trade being secondary. And this is where history gets interesting. Some records paint this voyage as an individual operation by Masamune. Others say it was authorized by the Tokugawa shogunate as an overall strategy. There is no way that Masamune did this without the knowledge and approval of the Tokugawa. Unfortunately, relations regarding Catholicism were about to reach a boiling point. The entourage reached Acapulco, the first stop on its multi-year voyage, on January 25th, 1614. The Tokugawa Exclusion Edict was released on February 14, 1614, roughly three weeks after the entourage arrived in Acapulco. Please follow or subscribe for more on Tsuninaga's historic voyage to North America and Europe. And if you like Japanese history, please like, share, and check out the rest of my videos. Thank you very much.